Hi, I'm Dan Kogan with Access Security, and today I'm going to demonstrate the Splan Visitor Management System for you. Here we have a self-service kiosk. This system can be set up in either a self-service kiosk or using a receptionist at a computer. This initial screen that comes up for any visitor visiting the site is displayed on an iPad. We also have a wireless printer that will print out the badge at the end of the registration process. The screen can be customized with a corporate logo, background image, however you may like. We're going to start out by doing a new registration. We have the ability to register three different ways in the system, either a manual registration, scanning of a business card, or a driver's license. This can be customized and options can be removed. So if you don't want manual registration or scanning of a business card and only a driver's license, that can be done where that is the only method that's allowable through here. We can also run a background check, which is able to be done uh, via sex offender or just background check. We can tie that to a database and have that ability as well. So I'm going to scan my driver's license. It comes up with an image as, as far as what the system is looking for. We're going to look at the rear of the camera, and there's some instructions here. And I'm going to place my license there. That takes a picture of the QR code on the license and then auto-populates the fields. These fields can be customized to however you may want and whatever information that you may want to grab from a visitor. We have right now the required fields of being a first name and a last name and then who you're meeting with. And I'm going to tap the who are you meeting with. That's going to come up and search a database. It can be an Active Directory or any sort of LDAP database. I'm going to type in a user that's in the system that I'm here to meet with. I'm going to select that user from the list. I'm then going to click Next. Once I'm done the registration process, that will then notify that person via either text or email, letting them know that the visitor is waiting for them. I can then capture my picture, so I'm going to stand in front of the camera. I hit the Capture button. That captures my photo for the ID badge. We then have the ability, this is optional, to put on a non-disclosure agreement or any sort of safety uh, acknowledgement for visiting the site, and the user would then sign for that acknowledgement. I'm then going to get my badge printed out. I've been registered successfully. The badge will print out of the printer. And I now have my visitor management badge. So when the visitor is ready to leave, they can also check out of the system. That's going to give you a mustering ability so you can know what visitors may or may not be on the premises still. So on the bottom here, there's a checkout. So I can simply hit the checkout. I can search myself either my first or last name or any sort of information that I use to check in at. But I can also use the QR code which is printed onto the badge and if I hold that up to the camera, it will automatically check me out. So I've now been checked out of the system and it returns back to the registration. I hope that's been a useful demonstration of the Splan Visitor Management System. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact us here at Access Security.